Welcome to The Daily Writer, where we share a lesson each day to help you cultivate the habits for creative success. The Christmas classic It's a Wonderful Life opens with a scene in heaven. Two angels are listening to prayers from Bedford Falls for George Bailey, a man who is in deep trouble. So they call in a third angel named Clarence, who's being sent to earth to help George. If he succeeds in his mission, he'll finally get his wings. But before Clarence is sent down, he's got to spend some time getting to know George. All he can see, though, is a blur, so one of the other angels has to clear his vision because Clarence doesn't yet have his wings. And with the senior angel's help, Clarence can clearly see so he can move forward with his mission. You know, there's a similar relationship between you and your readers. Your mission is to help them see the world more clearly. You know, it doesn't matter what you're writing, whether it's fiction or nonfiction, The mission is ultimately the same, and that is to help the reader get a clearer vision of life. So how is your vision? Do you see clearly? Nobody can believe your writing or believe the truth in it unless you first believe it yourself. The great novelist Charles Dickens wrote, I have nothing else to tell, unless indeed I were to confess that no one can ever believe this narrative in the reading more than I have believed it in the writing. So, is skill important? Yes. But skill is nothing without belief. When you believe in what you're doing and when you believe in what you're writing, you can take the reader anywhere you want them to go. Thanks so much for listening to today's episode. For more, you can visit us at dailywriterlife.com. Thanks, and I'll see you tomorrow.